One beautiful day on a green terrace there were farmers. As a good cold breeze flows over them, the farmers work hard and get really tired, but they always stay positive. In the old days, the farmers grew rice once a year, but now they plant rice three times a year. Three times takes all the nutrients out of the soil, and so it won't be sustainable. This is called over farming. Over farming also uses so much more water and pesticides. Pesticides can be very harmful to the water and everything living in it. Most of the rice fields in Vietnam are covered with water and mud all around the year. People could not do anything with this of land except planting rice. Rice farming is sustainable in Vietnam because we have a lot of farmer, we have a good land, good weather for doing rice farming. These farmers are bending over and planting seedlings, getting them from the basket, which is very heavy. And they do this all day long in the sunny rice paddies, which is very hard. They water until the rice grows. Rice takes three months to grow, and they can't spend time with their families on the weekends. The farmers use buffaloes to pull a tool called a harrow. This moistens the rice so the rice can grow into good quality rice. Then more people will buy it or they eat it for food. The rice grows and grows and takes about three months to mature. After the rice is grown, they will harvest and take it to sell in the market. Then they sell the rice. Did you know three-fourths of Vietnam's population eats rice because it is a traditional food? Then they sell the rice on the streets and often make it into street food to get more money. The rice is served. Rice can be eaten in two different ways. The first way is to use chopsticks, which most Vietnamese people use. Or they will use a spoon, which many people use when visiting. Yum! Rice is so delicious. It is enjoyed all over the world. Didn't you know Vietnam is the second best rice exporter in the world? Keeping rice farming sustainable across Vietnam ensures that the nutrients stay in the soil to keep the land healthy and then people can enjoy rice all over the world.